good day my audience you welcome once again to dr fred academy today we shall be looking at the muscles of the tongue that is the lingua muscles these muscles are actually divided into two main groups that is the extrinsic tongue muscles and the intrinsic tongue muscles the extrinsic muscles connect the tongue with adjacent structures while the intrinsic muscles originate and insert within the tongue. The extrinsic muscles are actually three of them. There are three of them. So we shall look at the three of them. The first one is the, the genioglossus. The first one is the genioglossus. So this is the genioglossus. Okay? The genioglossus. Okay, it actually originates from the from the symphysis of the mandible. That is the mandibular symphysis. This is the mandibular symphysis. Okay, and then it inserts on the median plane of the tongue. Okay, so it comes out from the this is a mandibular symphysis. Okay, this is the genioglossus, and inserts on the median plane of the tongue. The, this tongue, this muscle actually uh, functions to protrude the tongue. Okay, it protrudes the tongue, and it also retracts the tongue. The second muscle we shall be looking at is the hyoglossus. Okay, this is the hyoglossus. Okay, we are seeing it from the media or the mid sagittal plane. Okay, we can also see the hyoglossus from the lateral part. Okay, this is the hyoglossus. Okay. This muscle actually originates from the thyroid and basihyoid bones of the hyoid apparatus. Okay, from the thyroid and basihyoid bones of the hyoid apparatus. Okay, this is the basihyoid bone. Okay, this is the, the muscle. Okay, and then it inserts on the root of the tongue it inserts on the root of the tongue so coming over to this side we have the muscle here okay inserting on the root this is the root of the tongue so this is the the muscle and it is called again hyoglossus the third muscle we shall look at is the styloglossus okay i didn't tell you the function the function of the Hyoglossus is to retract and depress the tongue. Okay? It functions to retract and depress the tongue. So the next muscle is the styloglossus. Okay? This is the styloglossus. It's actually bounded by the mylohyoidus and the hyoglossus. Okay? This is a mylohyoidus, a hyoglossus. And then this is the styloglossus we are talking about. Okay? The styloglossus actually originates from the stylohyoid bone of the hyoid apparatus, which is when you go deeper, you get the stylohyoid bone of the hyoid apparatus. And it inserts on the middle of the tongue. Okay? It inserts, it goes to insert on the middle of the tongue, just like the genioglossus. And this muscle actually functions to retract and elevate the tongue okay it functions to retract and elevate the tongue so once more let's go through the three muscles again the first one we said it is the genioglossus this is the genioglossus okay this is the after the genioglossus we have the hyoglossus okay which we can also see on the lateral side okay the hyoglossus and the third one is the styloglossus. Okay? Now let's look at the intrinsic muscles of the tongue. Generally, the intrinsic muscles of the tongue are muscles whose fibers are arranged in longitudinal fibers, vertical fibers, and transverse fibers. Okay? And then these muscles have... Um, uh, 
different orientation, okay? And this orientation once more is longitudinal orientation, vertical orientation, and transverse orientation. And between the fibers of these muscles are fat deposits that give the tongue its uh, peculiar consistency, okay? Now, having said this, let's see other muscles around this area, okay? Other muscles we shall look at around this area include, number one, the, the digastricus muscle, okay? This is the digastricus, okay? Digastricus. This is the jawbone, that is the mandible. That is the vertical, the, sorry, the horizontal ramus of the mandible. This is the digastricus. Of course, this is the mylohyoidus, okay? Mylohyoidus. My, 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 Milo is actually a Greek word for molar, okay? So it actually originates from the molar area, okay, of the, uh, of the teeth, okay? And then insert on the hyoid apparatus, okay? That's the basic hyoid bone as well. So this is a mylohyoidus. It's also called a swallowing muscle. All right? We have said, okay, and then this is the, this is the geniohyoidus, okay? This is the geniohyoidus, and then just like we said earlier on, this is the, the genioglossus. So on this part, we have mylohyoidus, the geniohyoidus, and the genioglossus. Thank you for listening. I would um, advise, as usual, to, for you to subscribe to this channel, Dr. Fred Academy, and then do well to click on the notification bell icon if you, sub if you subscribe. Don't forget to drop your comments and then share. Thank you.